Hello guys and welcome back to Steinplay's Minecraft. I'm back on the server, still on zero deaths, and we've been making a lot of progress here. Just trying to get away from the sound of those chakans. Uh, I can't remember what I showed you before, but I kind of made the bell tower the front side. Uh, framed the windows a little bit. Kind of put a few blocks in the back up here been torching up the place. I had a lot of zombies killing some of my good villagers. Um, I've put some some dark grey carpet and some light grey carpet around. I'll show you why in a minute. Um, first I just want to show you the entrance. I think we're going to take it like that. I might hide uh, a bit more glowstone around. That might be cool. I've made a start on a tower. I'm going to put another one just over there. You can see that block there is the centre but it's going to be the same size as this one and I'm going to build a wall connecting around there and a wall connecting up and around there and that will be the front part of our our castle this could be like kind of our courtyard on the inside or we could have the courtyard over that side but not 100% um, decided yet but ooh, we're not going with us uh, I think it's this one. So the reason I put the wall across, nope, it's not that one. I made, I went back to spawn, made some copies of uh, the map set. Here we go. As you can see, they're different colours. If you see on the left side of the map, where I'm kind of heading towards now, it's uh, the light grey, and then the cobblestone grey, which is the same as the stone brick and the cobblestones. And then up here we have the dark grey again sort of bobbing again it kind of changes from the cobblestone colour here if you look makes a nice contrast there I think anyway I'm not sure how to deck out here I'm, I might leave it as uh, grass in this bottom layer but them layers around there I might change it a little bit I wanted something that would contrast a little bit. Um, I think we're, we're looking pretty cool on this map so far. Uh, not as good as I'd want it to look, as far as the map is concerned, but certainly looking good. In my opinion. Okay, so you can see I've got quite a pattern going on here. I've got a layer of stone brick, smooth stone, a couple of stone brick smooth stone, stone brick, couple of smooth stone, blah 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 all the way to the top um, ah, dang it wasn't sure how I could finish it really could bring it back out one layer uh, we've we've brought it in a couple of layers here it's a 19 diameter circle and then on top of that which the 19 diameter circle goes up one, two, three, four, five blocks. I might change this top row to stairs. I'm not sure yet. Might look cool with stairs all the way around. And then a 17, we've got three, four layers of. And then 15, so far we've got one, two, three, four, five. We've got a few. <laughs> a few, a few layers. We're going to have to count them, not now, but we will count them because we want the other side to be pretty much the same. So I'm thinking that this is tall enough for a tower that I'd like it to be. Sorry, let me be right back one second. Hey, sorry about that guys. Um, My stupid phone was ringing. I've got it on vibrates, so it's all good. Uh, I'm thinking that this is a reasonable height for the tower. Um, if you can see, ooh, where are we going? Yeah, it's quite a good height because that tower then will be up there, It'll be very high. Can't really see the mobs. Can see a couple of the, the villagers all kind of gather around that side. I'm guessing because I've got them few extra doors at the top, it moves the centre closer to that side, and that's probably why no one's over here. But if I put some more doors, are about the same distance that them ones are. Maybe it'll bring them back. We're going to try that. Uh, so pretty much, 
I've got some dirt as well, which is cool. I'm going to bring the dirt over this side. So we're going to bring these out. Is it center? Yep. So we're going to bring this out. One, two. Pretty much just copy the uh, the pattern on the floor. But I'm only going to come out to the 17. So then we got two to the side. One, two. And then two to the side again. Ah, it makes it L shape. Yep, that's right. And then two to the side. And then so we've got two corner, two flat. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And it spins around again two. Spins around again in an L shape. Like a soul. And then two more this way. And then we're back to the other half of the circle. So we've gone round just over half the circle here now. Um, I'll leave the ladder there for a minute. I don't want to block it off just yet. So there. Um, should have put it there really, shouldn't I? Would have been using your brain a little bit. Two. L shape. As you can see I haven't really done anything on the inside of there. Put the two, yep, and then the five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Nearly done. This is the slow one. The next one should be a little bit quicker. Next layers. because I won't be so scared to hold on. I won't be so scared to hold on to shift so much because it's easier. Hmm. Do we want... We want to use that same pattern we've been using. So let's go ahead and get some uh, smooth stone on the bar. We will bring the dirt just in case. So what I've been doing is for the corners Uh, I've been still using the stone brick, but for everything else, I've been using the smooth stone. Um, the corners of the flats at the sides, the four sides. That's getting a little bit dark up here. I've only got four candles. Four candles. If you don't get that reference, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, yep. That's right. You, you, you. Whee, scary. You, you. You. <laughs> it's you to win the lottery, eh? You could just do as you please then. It'd be awesome. Okay, so then we go up one more, in fact. So we go back round with another, another layer of smooth stone. Like I said, this is going to be the top layer. Um, not this one I'm doing, this 17 diameter circle. I'm not going to go back out to the 19 diameter. Uh, I will put one through the middle there this time, because I can get underneath that ladder. Um, oops. Back with my mouse. Oh, we've got silky. We've got silky. Aren't you there? Did I bring enough smooth stone with me? Bought a little bit more. Just don't know whether I'm going to have enough uh, stone brick to fill it out. And that's it. Then we just top this off with one, one layer of stone bricks. 
all the way around. And then I'll try and make... I keep thinking the word crenellations. It's probably not the right word. Um, the turrets. Whatever we want to call them. I'm going to try and try and do some turrets around. I'm not sure. Um, we've got five on the outside here. So it should be cool. should be alright. Not, not sure what to use blockwise for them. Um, there we go, that's all the way around. Let's just put some ladder so we can get up and down. Can we get on there? Probably not. Yeah, we can get on there. And then we can get down there. Good. Okay. Let's just put this one here. So we can just walk our way up. So, blockwise, blockwise, blockwise. I was feeling the stone slabs. Just like so. Not sure if this is going to work out. Hopefully. Ah, yeah, beautiful. That's going to work out just fine. Thank you, Rain. Hopefully all my villagers haven't died while I've been uh, running around building this. I'd normally just go and sleep, but I need to get a little bit done. don't want to keep having a running off to go and sleep every five minutes. So how was your Christmases? Did you get everything that you wanted? Did you give everything that you wanted? Like I said before, I like to give Christmas presents rather than receive them. Got enough to make a workbench. So I made sure uh, my little girl got some, some nice presents. I think they were nice anyway. Wow, that was too many. But we had fun on Christmas. We had a good day. And I'm still not at work, which is awesome. Okay, I don't know whether to bring these up higher one. Uh, like this maybe. Nah, that's too much, too much. I can tell it's too much. Just going for the standard castle-y looking castle. Nothing too fancy. Nothing like Mr. B00's castle. Let me, is that mob? Hey guy, what are you doing there? In the rain, not moving. Oh, you stopped walking. Get dead. And you, spider. Good boy. Okay, so... There's another one there. Hello. Oh, you've got my block for me. What a gen. Why is that bugged out, that light there? Ooh, can hear a skeleton. Where are you? Okay, it just looks a little bit dark over here. Let's put the rest of these torches out. Hello, creeper. Get dead. Okay, so let's just drop down. We'll make it day and then we'll have a look to see what she look as the like? Um, the other reason why I'm, I'm put the turrets on the top instead of making it like the bell tower. Let's get the map back out. Which was it? This one. I'm sure, it was this one. Yes. Because when uh oh look, we can still see the dirt from the scaffolding on the inside. Uh, let's just check there's no no mobs about. The little babies. I threw a few of their their mates down in the bottom here. So we've got some new babies. Aha! That looks very plain and very boring, which is great. Um, yeah, actually I'm thinking maybe 
Maybe we need another another block. Hard to see anything there. Any details behind the sun. But for a start, I think that's not bad. We need to dress it up with some windows. Uh, some little balcony parts. But until I get on the inside and start messing around, I don't know at what height so I'm going to want windows and things like that. So we could certainly use the tower. Um, let's go and bash a hole in it. Let's see what kind of space we've got. So we've got a 15 diameter circle. Uh, let me in. Thank you. Do we need these blocks here? No. Let's just get rid of these. These were to mark centers when I was building. Is that it? Yeah, do we need the corners there? Nope. Oops. Want the corner there though. Ah, we've still got silky. Stop using it. Not as it matters. We're going to repair them both anyways, probably. Um, three. Want some dirt? Da, 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 da. There we go. Uh, let's just get rid of these. Goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Okay, so that's all of them annoying blocks which were annoying me. Gone. Uh, can we reach these? reach that one. I don't think we can reach this one though. No, nope. definitely not. We jump here. No, it'll be just easier to build. Uh, let's get them in there so that they can grow. We'll try and do it on a torch. Let's just bring this across a little bit. In scaffold to break down scaffold. See, I used these when I was building around the corners. On the flats, it was easy, just stack up and go. But needed a little bit of scaffolding. Oh, come on. For these, for the turns. Yes. I want to get rid of them. Oh, nearly. Come on. And you can't reach. <laughs> so I'm gonna lean over. That should get it. There we go. We just got that top to clear off. We clear that off. Um, we clear that off from the ladder. It's not gonna pile all the way up there. Let's pick up these blocks. Sure, mob spawned in here. Got some. Here we go. Just a couple of torches. Where are they gone? Want them there? You can go there for now, then. Uh, just fram around like a maniac. Don't want to bust in here and have a creeper there. I mean, it's quite an easy pattern. I'm not going to forget where blocks go or anything like that. So yeah, we've got quite a big, nice looking cylindrical tower. Hmm. We can just put these blocks back there. That's pretty cool. Still not this site. Oh, no, we'll leave that there because we can come back through there. Um, we still need to knock out a few of the blocks around the outside. Uh, around here. I left these waters there just for now. In case we want to run a moat around, it'll make it a lot easier to run a moat around if I've already got um, some water source blocks there. Weep. Nearly fell off then. Yep. <laughs> Scary times. Let me through. I think it's easier just to hold the run button. Weep. Get me through. I definitely don't want to fall, that's for sure. I think I'm pushing my luck though. Just get, ooh, should we torch it up? 
No, it's alright. We can have mobs up here. They probably won't fall on us. They probably won't. <laughs> Famous last words. Did we put the... Let's put another ladder just there. There we go. We can just jump up there now. Can we get up? Yep. Nice. Okay, so as I was saying, the reason I didn't put the pitched roof on there, on here... Oh, we can't even see it on there. But, uh, we can put some different coloured blocks as the, the top level floor here. And that will make that green circle a coloured circle. And I think we can make the map look better that way. So, that's what I think we're going to do. Let's get back down here. I would like to fall into that water, but I know what would happen. I'd hit off the side. <laughs> so, future plans for for this site here. Um, oh, I killed a hell of a lot of chickens. There's not a little chickens. They weren't really lagging me, but there were so many, they were so noisy. It was rather annoying. Oops, trying to throw a bit of, <laughs> trying to throw some pork at the wall. Look how many eggs. Who needs seeds when you've got this many eggs? Let's move the map so we can get a couple of stacks on the bar. Hopefully these chickens ain't too loud. I did turn the volume down to 30%. Come on. There's not really that many chickens being born, but when you keep popping back in here, they're just baby making machines. And a lot of these eggs do turn out to be chickens. Some of them have four in, some of them have one chicken. Some of them have none, the majority I'd say. The majority of eggs have no chickens in. We've been collecting up the reeds uh, every now and then. One of my paper guys died, which was a shame. Uh, we've got a few stacks of paper ready to trade. Uh, I might just take a couple of, couple of stacks. Let's get rid of them. So we've got space for some emeralds. Let's go and find him. Which one are you? Hello my friend, where have you gone? It's not you. I know him because he had a compass as the first trade. Shh, don't look at these houses. Oh, you got it as your first trade. Let's see what we can unlock with you. It's a bit expensive though. But paper's so cheap, okay. You finish trading with me. Anybody else in here? Hiding behind the wall? I wonder what you're going to unlock next, my friend. Nothing. You bugged. I'll bug you out. Damn it, I'm going to have to push you down the hole. Nice no, gathering of people along here. But the guy who I want is not here. Where has he gone? Is he upstairs? These are still not made. Oh, I never showed the, the houses how I did them downstairs. But Oops, two guys in there. No one in there, no one in there. I've just been spamming the doors in. Uh, trying to make the outside look okay. Then on the inside of these ones, I thought for now I'll just make it one big open space. It's just easier that way. Um, where did you go? Is it you? No, you're the guy who needs to die, but I can't just stab him because the golem will get me. Probably. Is he over here? No, where is he then? I can't believe he'd be over there, because none of them go there. Or did all my paper guys die? Come back. Yep, you're not him. Well, oh, I guess he must have died. Not in here. Let me out. You in here? 
Aha. It's you. There you go. So this guy is a little bit cheaper. We can get as many as we need of him. And because I'm worried about him dying, um, what I'm going to do is put a block outside of the door. There we go. Now you can't get out. So just keep trading with this guy until he won't trade anymore. Then we just wait for a minute or two until he resets his trade. There's people still out there. Still dark in place. I need to light up a lot of space. I don't know why that other guy bugged out. Yeah, he's still 27. So we're getting like two per stack. It doesn't take long to get them. Oop. Little baby zombie could get in there. I didn't think about that. Never mind. Let's just fill up on paper. Go back in there. See how many diamonds we can get off of this guy. Oh, that was definitely... That definitely sounded like a zombie. I can't trust these iron golems. They're idiots. Where are you? Really, I should go and sleep. It's far too dangerous. There's another one up there. Get dead. I'm trying to trade with my friend. So if they're coming over, let's, let's uh, turn it to day. Hello. Ah, there's two of them. Well, it seems they're spawning in such small spaces. That's a... Uh, Tony, Tony, got ya. Let's turn it to day. Maybe ultra hardcore mode should be um, no sleeping off the day, oh, off the night rather. That would be pretty cool. Because you can just wuss out and t like I just did, and turn it to day all the time. As soon as you're like, oh no. There could be baddies coming. Oh, there could be people up there. There you go. Anyone else? Can't see him. I mean, he was burning anyway, but still. Okay, let's get back in here with our guy. Hello, guy. Can we have some more of your lovely emeralds? What's this guy trading us? A redstone or a fortune axe? That's pretty useless, fella. I think I'm gonna have to push you down a hole as well. I mean, I don't mind having a few useless traders about, but I would like some good ones. Might knock all of the walls out. I don't know yet. But as you can see, we're just getting so many emeralds. I oh, don't want to trade again. Okay, okay. Oh, hello. Hmm. You're like the most useless one ever. Ah, oh, that doesn't look too good. Looks like a chess piece. It's a chess piece castle. Right, we can sort it out with some nice fancy windows later. One more. Thank you. Right, get out of the way. You. Let's uh, unlock your trade, see what you got. You might have something nice. What do you have? Eleven books. Okay. Let's 
take a demo for you. Quickly place these down. Wait, then run off. Then run off. Where are you going? Talking to you. Hey, come back. Oh, trade. I need to have a. Uh, where did that go? I need to have another paper guy. Well, I don't really need to have another one, but just in case my guy dies, I'd like to get another decent paper guy. Okay, room book. We don't want you. There we go, put the paper away. That'll do for the trading. Um, I think that'll do for the episode, actually. Just wanted to show the progress. I've not really been on too much. I've squeezed in a good few hours, so... Uh, just messing here and there. As you can probably tell, I keep sniffing. I've got a cold. It's, it was it did get pretty bad. I just wanted to go to sleep over Christmas, which wasn't fun. But, hey, we're getting better. That's the main thing. So, guys, let's just take one more look at the map. It doesn't look the best. Oh, what's that? Red. Aha, that's just that piece of dirt there. That's cool. So, the tower's looking nice like a, a hula hoop and once we connect the wall up um, we're probably going to build a five wide wall so that can come straight off of the side uh, one of these edges there to there from that way and we're going to curve it round to connect to this wall and like I said the same it's going to go up that hill and curve onto that wall well guys thanks for watching I appreciate it um, if you've got any comments or suggestions, uh, I'd really like suggestions about the flooring. The flooring, the flooring, the flooring. I don't really like it too green like this. Um, I did at first, but now now I kind of want to change it because I want to change these blocks there. I want to change it all really. But if you've got any suggestions for the floor, please give me a shout or leave me a comment. Um, and as always, until next time, I'll see you in another life. Take care.